Good morning. Good morning. It is Sunday. Sun no. Sunday. Yeah, it's Sunday. It's Sunday. I've switched to dates rather than days. Okay. Although I don't know what the date is either. The 10, 11. Basically, we don't know what day it is or what day it is, which is a good sign. It's a very good sign. It means that we've finally found our zen. We realised that after our massage yesterday, we both actually ended up feeling worse than what we were feeling to start with. That skimping out on the massage wasn't the best choice. Still really enjoying Udaipur, and the weather today is absolutely spot on. Everyone's so close. And today we have absolutely nothing to do apart from chill, eat, stroll, drink, visit the lake, and try not to get run over. Delhi Belly has officially cleared for some, but not all. Sam and I have found a luxury boat cruise for a local yacht. Uh, we've had to call this one in straight from Marbella. How many foot is this, dude? 150 foot? Yeah. About 150 foot yacht, I think. Not the boat is small, it's like we are gigantic. You excited that I'm driving now? Slash nervous. <laughs> is this as fast as this goes? Yeah, flash done. stopping us now. We're going a full maybe eight mile an hour <laughs> and we're just about burning the engine out. I also feel like an absolute giant in this boat. If Noddy had a boat this is exactly what it'd be like. We've just been speaking to a local in a, in a cafe to make sure that we're not missing out on anything. He said the number one thing to do in Udaipur is literally just to chill out, go for a wander, go to the lake. So for the first time on the trip, we don't feel like we're missing out on anything. Massages are a really big thing here. Aravetic. Aravetic massage, that's the one. Uh, we've taken it upon ourselves to find Udo Paul's finest Aravetic massages. I do feel like our sense of calm has been fully warped by the madness that we've seen in the last week though. Still pretty nuts. I don't think I'm ever going to mind being beeped at in the future. No. I feel like I'm now immune to being beaten. We'll be wandering across the road in England and people will be beeping their horns. Hi. Oh, hello. hello. <laughs> nice to see you. Beeping is like the international language of India. No matter what you're doing or where you are, just beep your horn. If you're ever traveling with this guy, you've got to look out for three signs. Number one, you start sweating. Number two, it goes very quiet. And number three, he starts taking slow and steady water steps back to the direction of a safe toilet. And what does that mean? Delhi Belly. Delhi Belly <laughs> is about to strike. <laughs> Let's give him a big hug. Let's give him a big hug. <laughs> These are the roadworks that woke us up at seven this morning. Literally everything is done by hand. It's like pretty hardcore. Yeah. We finally made it to the massage place. We managed to procrastinate from even getting into a massage place. Six hours later. <laughs> that's, how, that's how relaxed the day's been. But we did see the sun setting from the rooftop. Gulson's opted for the massage without the head and hair massage. Balding problems. <laughs> Second massage down. Indian head massage at the end as well, which is leaving me with a lovely barnet. I think that, that style of massage is just a bit different. You know like Asian massage places, like Thai massages, they'll find like a knot and they'll basically just like dig it out, won't they? Yeah. Whereas I think these ones are more focused on like your energy sources. The perfect chilled day in Udaipur has finished with the perfect chilled evening. Cheeky little rooftop dinner overlooking the lake. This place really is something special. If you're in India, couldn't recommend it enough. Although like most places in India, it all pretty much shuts down by this time, about midnight. Apart from the odd motorbike, the odd car, and of course, the odd cow. Back now. 
So chilled. Did I mention it was really chilled? Tomorrow we're just moving city once again. Uh, one that we're both pretty excited about. Flying to Mumbai. But until tomorrow, that is all from us today.